Heart attacks are a medical emergency. Every minute counts. And more people than ever are surviving them thanks to prompt treatment. Like Neil Granger, but patients can be left with a permanently weakened heart, making everyday tasks difficult. So now, a week after cardiologists at the London Chest Hospital saved his life, they're trying to repair his heart. With these, stem cells taken from his bone marrow, which they inject direct into his heart. It's come from yourself to mend yourself. It's, a, it's, it's not something I've ever thought of as being possible, but it's fantastic. So could those cells mend his heart? Well, a heart attack happens when the blood supply suddenly gets blocked, usually by a fatty deposit of cholesterol. Heart muscle starts to die because of the lack of oxygen. Urgent treatment is needed. The narrowed artery is cleared and a metal mesh, a stent, left inside to keep it open. But the damage caused by the attack can continue for several days. The injection of the patient's own stem cells through a tube is an attempt to halt that damage, maybe even reverse it. The cells release chemical messengers, which hopefully kick-start the heart's natural repair mechanisms. That could mean patients are left healthier and less at risk of long-term heart problems. Neil Granger will be monitored for five years to see if his heart improves. He's taking much better care of himself now, especially his diet. Salt was the big problem with my extra salt and everything, and uh, I've done it ever since I was a child. I didn't think my body shape fitted a heart attack to a person, um, so I was surprised. There have been several small trials using stem cells for heart repair. This study will show for certain whether the treatment is effective. If this trial is positive, the benefits for, for patients are that we have something to deal with the problems that heart attacks can cause that we've never ever had before. And for the overall field of medicine, we have a, a, whole, new, a whole new branch essentially has opened up. This trial is not being funded by a drug company. You can't patent a patient's own cells, so there's no profit in it for them. Instead, it's being backed by the European Commission, the hope being to create a treatment using these cells, which saves the NHS money and saves lives. Fergus Walsh, BBC News.